right, ladies and gentlemen, so we have the Airbus A318 to start off with, also known as the Baby Bus. So, I don't know, where would this go on the tier list? Probably a C, I would say. It's definitely not my favorite. Okay. Not a B. Actually, I'd say B because it's not as bad as Embraer's. So you guys are making me do a tiebreaker. Honestly, yeah, I, know, I, I, I feel like the 319 would be a B. A 318 would be a C. 318 looks very tiny. Uh, you know it looks very Yeah, let's go. I, I say C. I say okay. C. Yeah. Alright, we have the 777. 777. Too good. Too good in the aircraft. Not gonna lie. Species. Uh, on- Continue. Triple seven. It has to be on top. That's one of my favorite water bodies. So, triple S. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay, we'll go with the S. We have the E one seventy five. Now, honestly, I'm, a... I'm not a fan of yeah. Embraer. I'm not a fan of Embraer. Me neither. Yeah. I've never been Actually, on it. We should like... be saying Embraer because Sophia's <laughs> in here, and if if you guys follow Sophia on TikTok, you already know the Embraer meme, <laughs> pretty much. So yeah, Embraer seven one seventy five. I'm not a big fan. I'm not a big fan. I'm gonna... I don't know. F or C? I feel like it doesn't deserve to be an F. Like, it definitely is a C. Okay, I'm gonna put it. I feel like it's nothing. Alright, next. What is it? Airbus A220. Oh. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Personally, it looks nice. And I like the way it looks. And I like, apparently, the whale whale sound it makes. But... I feel like it's definitely not in the A or like with the triple seven. Definitely does not compare. Mm-hmm. Maybe a B, I'd say. Okay, Adi, your opinion? I think it's in it's in the middle, and the favorite part is it kind of looks like a mix of like the if you see the cockpit part, like you'll see like a part of the A seven, and then a little bit of oh yeah, the, the, like the, next like next the, thing it would be you know oh yeah. That does well, look good. Yeah, that's what B2. Uh, yeah, honestly, I'm surprised because A220 can do, like, long range. Like, they do white planes to LAX on Breeze Airways, A220. I- I'm surprised. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just started that flight. Like, it's, I think, 5 hours, 30 minutes from white planes all the way to LAX and back. So, I am surprised. But it is a little tiny, so it could get uncomfortable if you're doing a whole cross-country flight. So, I'm going to put it at B. Okay, now we have the butter machine. A330. A. I've been on an 11 hour flight in that. Yeah. You legroom you did JFK to HNL, right? Yes, I did. Yeah. I, I want to fly the Airbus A330. I genuinely do. I'm gonna For me, it's A. the 738. Aren't you flying on one in like 10 days? Oh, I'm flying on a Max 8, yes. Oh, yes, true. 737, 900, and 800. Now, honestly, I flew... Not a big fan. Yeah, same. I'm not a big fan of the 9... I'm, I'm a, I'll am I'm slide with the 900, but not the 800. I am not a huge fan of the 800. I feel like it's uh, definitely giving B. The maxes are definitely A's and S's, but um, the 800 and 900 are definitely, like, B. Yeah. Honestly... Did you- I'll say C. I'll say C for the 800s. I don't know. I want to go with B. A C for C for eight hundred, but like nine hundred is a B. So I'm gonna keep it yeah. in the middle of all of these right here at B. Because no. I honestly did not like the leg room on an eight hundred. And the IFE is really old, especially in United. Yeah, 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 exactly. Okay, seven six seven. I don't know why I love the seven six three. Like that is one of my favorite planes. So I would rate it like on top, but like. Mm-hmm. At the same time, the 400 is meh. Like, I'm not a fan of the 400 as much. You've flown the 767 how many times? Three. Three times, yeah. Okay. I've done it Newark to Venice. Yeah, true. I've never flown the 767. And honestly, if anything... It had a really good leg room. If, yeah. If anything, I want to do JFK to LAX with Delta on the 767 or it's expensive H- yeah or ewr to hnl on board or vice versa back on the 767 so i don't know i i'm not a huge maybe, fan of it 
maybe A or B because I feel like it's definitely not a C or an F. Maybe not yeah. a, you know, like it kind of is in there, okay. but I feel like it's kind of giving A three thirty. You know, kind of feels like it belongs with A three thirty. Adi. Yeah, I'd say A because I feel like it's the predecessor of the triple seven. It looks, it's look, it looks really similar. Yeah, it does. All right, well, A. Okay. All right, now we have the Airbus A three forty. Hate it. I hate it. <laughs> I don't know. F. I just feel like it's a bad concept overall. F. F? Oh, God. How F? badly do oh. you hate it? It's so... It gives me such, like, an ick. How long it is, how skinny it is, the four engines, just everything. Uh, well, the 300 and 600. So which one would you, like... Cause you, Both of them. Both of them. Adi? I would not say F. I would say I saw the B. B? B? Cause it has you can't like you you can't go wrong with a four engine like quadruple engine aircraft like literally you can't. I like mean, a seven forty seven, which not the A three forty. Okay, fine. The Maybe I'll move it to C, but definitely not B. Okay, let's keep it in the middle. That I guess at C. All right. Yeah, because I don't honestly I like the gear on there, like the gears. I don't know how Sophia hate absolutely hates it, but like. I like I like the gear uh, on the bottom, the little tiny gear in the middle. Mm -hmm. right, now we have okay. the king of the skies. King of the skies. I'm not going to speak on this one because you guys are going to hate what Dang. I have to say. Okay, yeah, <laughs> obviously. The Airbus A380. Hmm. Honestly, I want to fly. Listen, it might sound weird, but am I the only one who looks like who looks at the A380 as a bald plane? A bald. Yeah, if you look at if you oh look my at God, the eighty, it kind of does. Oh, yeah, the the really... upper part, the upper part looks like it's bald. Especially with this livery on Eddie Hat Airways, you're wrong. You're right, actually. Bro, but honestly, Bro, I don't I, fly, I want to fly the Airbus A three eighty, like eventually from like JFK to Dubai or LAX to Dubai. So, what would you rate it? I don't know. Um, A or B? A or B? <laughs> I don't... I would say B. I would say B. In Dubai. Yeah, 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 exactly. Get right. that down to B. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll put it at yeah. B. Oh, this one. A321. And this. I love the A321. A engine yeah. noises are beautiful. The beautiful engine noises. I had to go around in it. I loved it. <laughs> the fact I fly. that you've been on the specific plane in this picture. Yes, Crockett the Raccoon. Yes. A321. So, yes. Audi? A. I got okay. both opinions. All right, hey, got it. Oh yes, I spotted this livery actually. I in Denver. The seven fifty seven. I feel like is uh, belongs to the triple seven for me. I don't know why. I just have a thing for it. I love the seven fifty seven, especially the United liveries with like United the United and Delta. Delta like and I Delta. Love Delta bro. Like I love the seven fifty seven. Like that's up there for me. Like on top. Yes. Buddy. Yeah. I'd say you know what. This is the true pencil of the skies. Yeah, yeah, if you compare right. this with the A340-300, this is the winner for flying pencil. Yeah, so that should definitely be up up on top. Yes, okay, that'll go up at S. Oh my god, oh. wait, they kind of, the 777 and the 757 kind of line up, look. Oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that. Oh, that's cool, that's cool. That is very cool. The E190. Oh, I've been on, oh, I've been on the specific livery, if you guys haven't already watched my video. Definitely go ahead, check it out, it's on my channel. But yeah, E190. Honestly. Never been on it, so I don't have to say. I have been on it. I'm not a huge fan I'm... of it. Like, I would not do a flight from EWR to MCO on board an E190, because I know they do that. I would not sit there for two hours in that plane. Even though I like the IFE system, even though it's somewhat old, but the plane is tiny. The plane is very tiny. Then would you say B or C, probably? I, I don't want to go with... I'm gonna go with or F. Definitely not F. I, I somewhat still like it because I've I've been in the something top needs to go down in F. Honestly, true. Yeah, true. Probably the E one seventy five would. Wait, do we? You know what? Let's move. It? Let's bump the E one. No, wait. No, I like the E one seventy five and C because like I kind of like the way it looks better than like the wingtips make me really happy. Oh, true. I don't know. I I want to go with C for the E one ninety. Great. I literally have no comment because. <laughs> In the five eleven person, I feel like I'm bigger than the whole fuselage. Like, <laughs> I'm five foot two, so I'm five eight, and I had to duck down when I boarded the aircraft for the first time. 
Yeah, no, I don't think I'm going to fit in that. So. The 747. No 747, the queen of the skies. It's way too... Like, B. B? B or C. It kind of gives me F. the F. Why does it look like that? Actually, you know what? Who said F? Adi? I said F. I said I S. Ag- Did you say F? S. S as in Sierra. I, oh, I heard Foxtrot, bro. <laughs> I'm not gonna say pasta. Why would you give it's it? Not, the it's not. It's not the S. No, no. It's, it's the not. Queen of the I'll I'll double down from the S. I'll I'll go with a solid B or A. Let's put it in A. Honestly. Oh hell. Yeah, it's an A. Let's put it at an A. Oh, the Airbus A350. I think that's a- the longest a- range, right? I think A350 1000. I think is, but I feel like that definitely belongs with. The A330 and 767, you know? True, yeah. Like, I mean, it's definitely yeah. not... The 900 series is used for the world's longest flight from JFK to Singapore, right? Oh, yeah. sure, yeah. Maybe, okay. then we put, should, maybe then we should put it up top. True, yeah. Honestly, it, sh- it deserves to be up there. The A319. Yeah. What's the... Let's do that one. I've been on one. Um, yeah. The leg room yeah. on United's was almost better than the 738. I will say that. Mm-hmm. But it was really tiny, and I didn't really like how small it was. Yeah, it is, it, it is quite tiny. I don't mind. Like, I don't want to be sitting there for, like, more than two hours. I can guarantee you that. Mine was an hour and 20 minutes, so it was nice, yeah, but... Indy, right? No, that was on an A321. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. That was... It was my fr- flight from Atlanta to Newark on United. Oh, I was on a 319. Okay. That got delayed, like, crazy. <laughs> A319. So w- what would you say it is? B or C? Okay, Adi. I'll say B. I'll say B. 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 Okay, I already yeah. see them. Yeah, and I already see which one's next, and uh, that's S. <laughs> that's a that's non negotiable. So thirty seven max A, like that's, that's non negotiable. Put that right up there. Yeah. Wait, it's, wait, hold on. Seven thirty seven max A is like good. At least superior. My favorite aircraft now. Seven eight seven ten. Well, obviously, you're gonna put that in S if it's your favorite aircraft. I would, right, 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 because obviously it's my favorite. But I don't want to be like those. I feel like you should because it's like a really good aircraft. I really like it. It looks nice. I love the wing um, looks. Like whenever I go, that's past, my favorite. I go plane spotting. I see the wing flex. It's it's too good. It's too good. Along with the Max Eight, which I'm flying on in ten days. You're lucky. I know. Yeah. Everyone should track my flight. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'll I'll leave up the information on the screen right now. Yes, yeah. UA fifteen fifty. Yep. All right, the Airbus A three twenty to end off with. Okay, I'm not talking on this one. I'm not talking either because I've never flown an Airbus. Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> I have never flown an Airbus in my entire life. Only okay, well, it. the Neos are really, really nice. Well, I've only... Mm, the A320 PTU is what gets me. I love it. Oh, yeah. You showed the me dog video. barking? Yes. You showed I me know. Video. It just keeps going. That was actually on a 319, the one I showed you. Oh, oh, okay. But they all have it. Yeah. I'd say maybe it belongs with the 319, maybe B. Uh-huh. Because I don't... I feel like it's not as good as the 321, because the 321's, like, the engine noises on it are good. The 320s were just mad. They're a little smaller. Um, like, there's not as many rows in front of the engine. Like, for the 321, rows 1 through, like, 12 are in front of the engine. Yeah. Or for the 320, it's only, like, rows 1 through 7. So it's, or 1 through 6. So it's not as good. So I feel like it's kind of with the 319. So I'd say B. Adi's opinion? Yeah, I'd say B, too, because, like, I think it's a cleaner aircraft in terms of cockpit. Like, it, it's really clean. If you go to, like, the, like, the upper panel, too, it has one of the most cleaners. I mean, like, this is the only aircraft um, that I fly, but in Microsoft Flight Simulator. I've but... been in the cockpit of a Frontier 320, actually, and it was really yeah. nice. It was my first time in the cockpit, so, I mean, yeah, probably B. Okay. All right, we'll go with B then. Yeah, it's B. All right, so here we go. We got all of our aircrafts up here. We have nothing in F, which is kind of surprising. But honestly... These aircrafts are supposed to be where they are, if I'm not wrong. You're not wrong. Yeah, do we need to make any corrections? Nope. Oh, no. 
Uh, I was gonna say like if it's a plane, it's you should have put a bird in there. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, so like editing me to just you know fit a bird. Wait, where though? No, you should have added like you know how we do the planes. You should have put a bird in there. Oh yes, the bird. I've been like it's our savior. Oh yes, the bird. Uh, citation bird citation three hundred four. Yes. <laughs> yes, exactly. All right, well that's the end. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. It's video about products. And I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you.